There is severe penalties against individuals that are cutting cords or vanishing energies without having the uh, spiritual authority or the spiritual rank to do so, right? There is um, a fucking, there is a level, right? Uh, a spiritual and physical rank level, right? That you need to uh, be in order to ha be anointed to do that, right? I am seeing a lot of individuals everywhere, all over social media, you know, vanishing and cutting cords or talking about the twin flame journey that are not even on the twin flame journey. They say they are, but they're not because they're not divine. They're not. Okay. If they're not celibate, you're not divine. If you're don't come from royal, from like the, like holy bloodlines, then you can't be calling yourself divine. There is a, a specific amount of chosen ones that actually come from specific type of lineages that are high rank spiritually and physically. Okay. Um, so <laughs> a lot of individuals that are doing readings are not even authorized to give those type of readings. And by all means, the information, the, it's like misinformation that they're providing to everyone and all this are karmics. <laughs> and there is like severe penalties for that. Okay, if there, if you're doing any type of spells and shit like that, um, against the real chosen ones, or you're calling yourself a goddess or divine without being divine, where without actually having that bloodline within you. The hell it's these are not nicknames these are spiritual names we have birth names we have spiritual names and we have nicknames there's a difference right um also uh, evil energies or entities demonic forces have the ability to possess different bodies at the same time that's why you get the same, same type of karmic relationship. 